Hi, today we're going to see how to send an email back to the user. This means that we need to change the email message according to what they've input in the form email box. Here we've got the form. Now we'll go to the admin. We'll click on wizard edit to edit our form. We're going to leave the form itself unchanged, but click the events tab. Scroll down. We have one email here already it's sending to the admin, though in fact it's disabled on this form. We we'll drag in a new email event, move it up before the thanks message, click to configure it. Enable it, add an action label so we can tell what it is. This is to user. We'll go to the static tab, leave the to field empty. We'll add in a subject, just thank you. Thanks for your message. We'll add in a from name, site admin, and the from email, admin at mydomain.com. Now we'll go to the dynamic tab to add in the user email. Now this is a variable, it comes from the form, so we need to know the name of the form input we're going to use here. We'll just save the changes we've already made. Close that dialog, go back to the form element, email, and check what the name is. It's the name input there, it's email. But it may well be something different on your form. Go back into configure our email, into the dynamic tab, and we just type in email here, no brackets or quotes. So we'll go back and edit the template while we're here. In the same way as we used email there, we can use name here, which is the name of the name field and we put it in curly brackets in the template. Thank you for your message, Site Admin. Very simple. Save, close. We'll add in a debugger here, just so we can see the output. Save the form. Go back to it. We'll complete the form. Name is Bob, email bob at example.com, subject problem, problems. I have a problem, please will you fix it? That's a very familiar support message, and we'll submit it. And there you can see in the debugger output, now there's the message, Dear Bob, thank you for your message. An email has been sent successfully to bobofbobjames.com. That's it. Thank you.